the frogfish, one of the strangest creatures in the sea. These colorful, sedentary predators have many remarkable adaptations that allow them to survive in the competitive underwater world. As masters of disguise, frogfish have the ability to camouflage into the surrounding reef. They strive to look like shelter or grazing ground to their prey, luring them in closer, a tactic called aggressive resemblance. Frogfish come in nearly every color and can change the color of their skin within mere days depending on the substrate they are currently on. They also have the ability to stop the mucus production on parts of their skin, allowing the local algae, hydroids, and other growth to attach to them, increasing their ability to blend into the reef. But why do they need to be so well camouflaged? They are using this camouflage to hunt. Frogfish sit completely still, blending in perfectly to their surroundings then use their fishing lure to attract prey to come in directly in front of their cavernous mouth. The fishing pole, called an ilicium, is their first dorsal spine modified to be able to wiggle in front of their face, while the fleshy lure on the end, called the esca, is designed to look exactly like food to the frogfish's prey. Amazingly, depending on where in the world the frogfish is, the esca can look very different to resemble the prey on that reef things like worms, shrimp, and small fish. The frogfish wiggles its lure, imitating how that prey item would move in the water to attract its own prey. This is called aggressive mimicry. Once the prey is close enough, the frogfish makes its move. It can open its mouth 12-fold and swallow a prey twice its size. The speed that the frogfish can open its mouth creates a vacuum inside of its oral cavity, its strike being as fast as six one thousandths of a second, making them the fastest striking vertebrates in the ocean. Because they are expert fishermen, frogfish have given up the ability for fast swimming and are actually very awkward when they try to move around. Frogfish don't have a swim bladder but can move on the bottom using their pectoral and pelvic fins like feet. When they want to swim, they gulp water and force it out of their small gill openings behind their pectorals, causing them to launch up into the water column, a form of jet propulsion. Once lifted, frogfish are much more graceful and can wiggle their body to swim short distances, a sight not many get to witness. But landing is always a little difficult. Next time you're underwater, if you see a rock frowning at you, take a closer look. It could just be one of these amazing fish.